kill people. A murder is committed and they all go out and see. And to make things worse, the police assigned Patrolman Bear to the team. Patrolman Bear reporting for duty, sir. I thought you were on slug detail at the laundromat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sir, I am going to ask you a few questions. Okay, just be subtle. Gotcha. All right. Which one of you killed the director? Not Not me. Me. <laughs> well, they're all in the clear, sir. <laughs> Benton High School right now. A trip. Yeah, <laughs> a trip. A long, a long, scary trip, really. Do you This is Philly 57, combined broadcasting in Philadelphia. Here's the story of a lovely lady who was bringing up three very lovely girls. All of them had hair of gold, like their mother, the youngest one in curls. It's the story of a man named Brady who was busy with three boys of his own. They were poor men living all together, yet they were all alone. Till the one day when the lady met this fellow, and they knew there was much more than a hunch. That this group must somehow form a family, that's the way we all became the Brady Bunch. The Brady Bunch, the Brady Bunch, that's the way. Um, 
Larry, how would you uh, view your senior year of high school in three words or less? Three words or less? Uh, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> Very interesting. <laughs> That's two words. We asked for three. Three? Okay. Nearly and very interesting. Joe Year. Joe Lear, how has your senior year been at uh, high, Bentown High School? Um, eh, it's been okay, I guess. Okay, I guess. That's all you have to say? Uh, I, was, I was hoping for that three words or less thing. Well, uh, in three words or less, how would you describe your senior year here at Bentown High School? Librarians are... Cochran? Um, yes, you have just won the uh, most... You were the favorite teacher of all the people in the high school. And we. how, do you, how does this make you? Fantastic. Fantastic. Just made my day. All right, yeah. The ballots were distributed in homeroom, and they said that you were their favorite all time librarian, the nicest person. Everyone wishes that you were their mother. <laughs> we're, uh, we're speaking here with uh, Alex Bernert. My new wardrobe. Where'd you buy this one? Um, I found it right in there. She, Alex finds her clothes now. She no longer buys them, she finds them. How has your senior year been so far? Pretty good. <laughs> We're right here. Miss Lenaris is pushing Matt. <laughs> Annette Logan, how's it feel to be a senior? Come on, Annette. Come on, Annette. <laughs> a frightening experience. Um, it was it was really good. And it was exciting. Uh, it was exciting. It was I fun. It was really it was exciting. Fun. <laughs> My senior year must be important. And uh, it is in a way. But I don't want to get too deep into that. Because I want to get deep into my artwork here. Yeah? Feels good to be a senior. Finally, I'll be out of this school for good. It's great. You don't have to go to class anymore. You can walk around the halls. You can do whatever you feel like doing. It's, it's the best. It's the ultimate. All right, Amy, this is it. You got to tell me how it feels to be a senior. Mark, I'm going to kick you. Kill you. <laughs> feels very good being a senior. Finally getting out of this. My senior is it's pretty cool so far. Um, I just can't wait to get out of here. Um, it's great to be a senior, but can I show you my art project? That's what I've done all year. <laughs> Matt, how's your senior year been this year? Great. Awesome. It's been pretty good so far. I hope it gets better when I get out of school. Well, my senior year has been an enjoyable experience for me in my childhood. I hope that all these other seniors have enjoyed their experiences as much as I have. Hi, Nanette. And that's about it. I just... Oh, man. I just hope that all you seniors have a nice life ahead of you. My senior year has been just standing with my favorite teacher, Miss Lenardis. Come here, Miss Lenardis. This is my favorite teacher. She is my Spanish board teacher. She is great. I'll tell you. This year is so great because of her. It's been great. Thank Can't you. Wait till it's over. Thank it you. feels great. Mr. Krauss, you're doing a wonderful job, buddy. You know, you kept me in line this whole year. <laughs> I'm going to miss you, Mr. Krauss. <laughs> We're here with Miss Potts, the art teacher, and uh, how would you rate the seniors this year? Absolutely marvelous. Do you like the high school a lot better than you do Armstrong? Oh, I think they're both nice. Yes, I like being here at the high school because the seniors are so wonderful. And you've seen all them grow up and nourish into beautiful young, Most young blossoms. Them. Most of them. Most of them. Most of them. Including me. Mark, you're in a category by yourself.
it's the best, especially Betty's, it's the best lunch server going. The school lunches are all right. These are ice cream, and that's about it. <laughs> this person here is Kim Steen. She eats pizza every single day, and that's really good. The mashed potatoes are good, but sometimes the tater tots are cold. School lunch plays an important part of my diet since, you know, it's the only place I really get fed well. And the cheese isn't melted on the cheeseburgers. Oh, I never eat them. I just watch him eat like three or four a day. I think they look pretty disgusting, but... It's up to whoever wants to eat it. I'd really like to uh, congratulate the ladies in the back. You know, they had a real good year making the lunches. And the pizza tastes like mattresses. School lunch. Look at the wide variety of food you get here. You get your chocolate milk. You get your pineapple. You get, well, ooh, this was a hamburger, right? Right. It was a hamburger. You get a good, well-balanced meal at Ben Salem. It's just incredible. <laughs> Everything's powdered and everything. It's, it's high quality protein. But everything else is okay. Except for the ravioli because it gets moisty sometimes. School lunch? That's the greatest. It's like dining in hell. It's yabba dabba delicious. It's yabba dabba delicious. I don't know if school lunch. It could be better. Everybody else at our lunch table lets their mommy pack their lunch every day. Especially Michelle Orkler. Her mommy packs a brown bag every day. Complete win. The four food groups, peanut butter and wheat chips. <laughs> We're going to make her buy lunch on the last day of school, though. I'm hung, I'm full. If you really want to clear your system, I definitely recommend the spaghetti. Uh, it hurt down. <laughs> Bummer. <laughs> we love it. Lunches are pretty good. So there's, I don't know, nutritional uh, value of them. 100% acid. Um, not, not. <laughs> How I view the seniors this right. year through rose-colored glasses. We're here with Trish Novak. Trish, how's it feel to be a senior? <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, how would you view the seniors this year? What seniors? It was a great year. I'm gonna miss it. Here with the uh, most popular guy in the senior class, Mr. Krause. Oh yeah. Every, yeah everywhere we go, that. everyone just says Mr. Krause is our favorite. We wish he was our <laughs> father. You need a haircut. <laughs> Senior year's been so far? It's been great. We've had a lot of fun. Wait, 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 wait. All right, ready? We're here with Kim Sphine. How's your senior year been so far? Great. 
And how's the Reese's peanut butter cup? It's delicious. It looks good. Reese's peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> I eat the middle first now. <laughs> I can't believe we're graduating in two months. Feel to be a senior. Mark, I'm gonna kill you. How's it feel to be a senior? It's there. It feels great, man. A month and a half to go. Great. I will graduate. This is my last year of high school. Feels great. <laughs> it's the best thing that ever happened to me, dude. It feels great. We're glad it's over. Great. It feels awesome to be a senior. Yeah. Earth great. It's <laughs> I'm glad that I'm finally going to be able to graduate from this wonderful institution of learning that we have here in Ben Salem. And um, I feel that it's a privilege to be able to graduate from Ben Salem, to know that you know, I had these four years of lots of learning experience. I don't know, it's senior. Uh, Bill, how's it feel to be a senior? Feels great. Feels great. This is the last year and um, getting out of here and going to college. On senior, let me tell you. Maka lady. <laughs> What? Feels great. My senior year's been good. I love Nikki Nolan. It's been great. <laughs> My senior year has been pretty great. I like being a senior. Um, I've had a lot of fun, and I know the the next two months are going to be the best. Um, senior week, we're there. Uh, graduation, watch out. Um, I'm going to miss Ben Salem. How's it feel to be leaving uh, Ben Salem High School? I mean, this is it. You know, all your friends are going to be disappearing. I mean, you're no more football. You're not going to be able to miss no more extra points. I mean, uh, this is it, Joe. This is this is it. This is the end of the road. I mean, how's it feel? Well, I never really gave it much thought, but you know what? It really is coming to the end now. And Mark, I'm really <laughs> Give me a hug, Mark. I'm going to miss you. I mean, I'm going to miss my old county because I'll never see him again and all that. I feel that you're leaving Ben Town High School. No, this is the end of your... Well, we're going to go back with you. We're going to go back with you. Let's go to the bathroom. Let's go. We're going to go to the bathroom. Funky coma data. Exactly what I was saying. You know, you know, I got a lot of things to do in life, so I'm glad to get out of here. It's been a long nine years. Ninth grade was great, and then we got this dude named Paolo Tucci with his beer and everything. And I think this is one of the best senior classes we've ever had at Penn Town. Uh, academically, sports, clubs. Uh, I've had so many every year that I've taught here, and uh, usually this is one of the best classes we've ever had. We're here with uh, John, uh, John Samad. He is the enforcer. He inst he. The rules are, he hammers them down, you don't cut school, you don't leave early. Everyone loves John. I mean, they kept him in line all year. No cutting, no escaping on that side, no driving around the back, no leaving when the buses leave early. Mr. John, he is the man, the security guard, the all-time god of security. <laughs> How's it feel, and how would you view the seniors this year? Oh, they're pretty good, they're real good. They treat you good? Yeah, all the seniors are fine, and... Uh... Everybody's good. We have a good time. We don't have no problems. Because you're the enforcer. No, I'm, I'm not. They say I'm the enforcer, but we have a good time. 
So that's all you need to know. There's, believe me, there's no, John is not lenient. He lets no one get away. <laughs> No, we don't, we keep them right in line, you know, we don't let nobody escape, nobody go for breakfast, nobody goes for lunch breaks, and <laughs> <laughs> we keep everybody right here. <laughs> well, this is it. Uh, I think, yes, I will miss my friends. It'll be tough to say goodbye to all of them, but uh, I'll always remember the fun times that I had with all of them, and hopefully I'll see them in the future. But for now, it's uh, hasta la vista. See you later. <laughs> the seniors? The seniors, I view them with utter contempt. <laughs> They're really a bunch of nice people. The few that will live by the end of the year. I'm gonna miss everybody here at Ben Sam High School that made my four years so successful. Especially the people. Get out of here, man. <laughs> let's, let's take take two, all right? Ready? Take two. <laughs> this four years at Ben Sam High School has been like the top experience in my life. I'm gonna miss all the people that made this such a great experience and you know I, I feel Ben Salem High School has built me such a great foundation and as I go on Ben Salem High School will always be in my memory. I'm kind of sad to see. Uh, come with me you're under arrest. What's next year? I don't feel like that. Look at me. All these women, you know what I mean? I got all these women in the world. I look good, they all waiting for me, you know what I'm saying? That's why I'm so ready to get out of here. I love the girls in here, but we only have a few of, you know, what I'm saying? Black girls. Yes, we only have a few of them. And, you know, if, if I was white, I'd be straight. I, I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. I was, come here, come here, come here, come here. If, if, if I was this mark, see, my name is Mark, too, but if I was this mark, I'd be straight. I have all the women. Due to the fact I look like this. But, but you don't have my women, and that's what matters. <laughs> I have Due to the fact I look like this, I have no women. You know what I mean? I don't have to to the prom. Can you believe this? Cute as I am. You want to go with me? Nah. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I'm about to close and close my remark. So I just want to let everybody know I'm glad to be here. Glad to be here. Yeah. Can I do a quick interview for you? Yes, you do. Come on, Keith. John Stewart. John Stewart. Oh, it's true. Yeah. Here, come on, please. Yeah. Please. You're going to have to this. See your class. Please. Right. I don't think I... No, you know, I'll, I'll get you out of class. Don't worry about it. I'll walk down to Mr. Condi's here. No, I don't think so. Please, you have to do it. Come on, please. No, no, I don't have to. Please. Do it. Do please. it. Right. Please. Yeah. Get I'm not. Um, yeah, please. Uh, what, what is wrong with all these cross country runners? No, They're also shy. No, 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 and tell me, you heard the question. How does it feel? Is it sad? It's sad because you may not ever see these people again, and you grew up with them, and it's very sad. Yeah, I miss Ben Selm High School, but um, you know, you got to move on. And uh, I'm really happy to attend the college that I'm attending. Uh, I'm attending Anderson University in Indiana. So. How do I feel? Um, I feel sad, and I feel as though it's going to be something that I'm going to miss. And you know, I've been going through high school and my elementary school and it's just <laughs> the kids are good to me so I'm good to them bunch of good kids we have here at Ben Salem High School I've been in Ben Salem for this is my this is 12 years and I'm kind of upset to leave because you know this is like all I've been my whole life but there's greater there's greater things down the road all right we're here with Mr. Weiner uh, how would you view the uh, seniors this year different Different. I, I think that would really classify it. Do you have anyone killing hamsters or anything as I did in the earlier No, years? it's been a great hamster year. Uh, everybody survived and made it through. No crayfish thrown out the window while you weren't looking? More. There's six weeks to go. There's a possibility we might get through with any fatalities this year. Do you have any animals in your room? <laughs> yeah, a lot. Then I wouldn't expect any casualties. Uh, <laughs> In fact, if you come around second period, I can show you quite a few animals. Hey, we're standing here with Hetty. Um, Hetty is my inspiration for food. I mean, every time I sit down to dinner, I think of her and wish that she was preparing a meal, not my mother or anyone else or my uh, girlfriend. Yeah, I, I hope she don't hear that. But, uh, I hope your mother don't hear this. Uh, yeah, but uh, <laughs> Hetty, she is the best. I mean, anyone out there that sits in cafeteria B will know that she goes out of her way. She'll do anything for you. She'll sneak that extra portion in for you just, just because she's uh, Hetty. And uh, Hetty, how does this make you feel? I mean, how makes would you, me feel very good. Would you, how would you view the seniors this year? I'd say they're fair. But fair? They're, 
they're they're much better than they have been over the years really you've, you've seen us grow and uh, uh, we've seen you grow and believe me when you came in at ninth graders uh, <laughs> we had a lot to be desired that's true <laughs> thanks now, a lot you're, you're really good trying to forget this kind of life. <laughs> Why would you want to forget this life? You're so popular. All right, uh, Chris, this is it. I mean, your last year, um, you're never going to see half these people again. This will probably be the last time you walk in this hallway or, you know, how does this make you feel? Um, sad yet happy because I'm moving on, going to a different school, going to meet a lot of new people, but sad because I'll miss a lot of my friends. These, a lot of these people I grew up with, I've known since I was real young. But, I mean, I'll try to keep in touch, but sometimes you can't. But I'll be sad. If everybody had an ocean across the USA, then everybody be so bad, like California. We'll be planning the room. Oh, gonna take real soon. Oh, Lights and down our oh, oh, Can't wait for two. Oh, we'll be gone for the summer. We're so far to stay. Tell the teacher we're so oh, surfing USA. Oh, I really can't believe, I mean, this is it. Um, four years of this place, I mean, uh, I remember screaming and hollering and saying, why do we have to go to high school? And, uh, you know, I'm really glad that I stuck through and uh, did everything. I mean, I can sit down and write a sentence and uh, I think a lot of people take that kind of stuff for granted. I mean, I, I learned a lot of things here. I met a lot of nice people. Uh, people really shaped me and made me the person that I am today. And, uh, you know, I, I think, Often the high school is taken for granted, and uh, when I sit back and just a tear actually start coming to my eyes, and I'm gonna miss this place a lot.
still a, uh, feel really depressed that I might not, might not see a lot of people again until another reunion. And I'm serious. Uh, uh, might not seem like this, but that's how I feel. I've said it to a lot of people. I know that I might not see them again for a while. And a lot of people have grown up with this in kindergarten. Whenever I'll never see them again. Never. Who knows what will happen. I am going to miss my friends a lot. So that's it. I don't know. Make new friends next year, wherever I go. And I don't know, Ben Salem High School has really helped me out in the past four years. It's getting kind of seeing everybody go. I don't know, it's, it's kind of happy because everybody's going to college where they want to go and everything, but I don't know, I think everybody's pretty happy about it. I am going to miss Ben Salem with all my heart, but I cannot wait to get out of this building. <laughs> Meet new friends. part of Ben Salem High School is friends and and teachers to have like have have the part to you graduate and have a nice time in, in your enjoyable year in your last year. I'm gonna miss all my friends but it's about time. And for those for those students who have worked diligently in the video field I don't expect to see them working at McDonald's and Kmart next year you know at the checkout counter. Oh, here. Doc Hi, Doc. How you doing? You ever go to Kmart? Doc, how you doing? keep it that way and that's kind of what this is about you know I could have got the president of the United States or uh, Batman or Robin to do this but uh, I want to say this you know I want to say that I know a lot of people are gonna be going out having a lot of fun tonight and they're gonna be going crazy and a lot of people may even be drinking and I'm not here to you know tell you what you can and you can't do but if you're gonna get behind the wheel you know don't do it if you're drunk it's not worth it you know I'm gonna I, I don't want to lose any of my friends and you know, worry about what other people would think. It, it just, it's not worth it. You can have a good time if you, if you absolutely need to drink, then stay home or stay somewhere. Don't drive. You know, no one told me to say this, and you know, no one's twisting my arm or anything. I'm doing this because I care, and um, that's all I have to say. Just be careful tonight.
Salem High School, all of you can look back on being a part of a tremendous year of accomplishments. Uh, state championships have been won this year. We've had a number of academic awards, uh, two athletic league championships, and many, many other things. Uh, whatever you're planning to do with your lives, whether it's going on to college, getting into the military, going out and uh, being part of the workforce, I wish you well. It's been a pleasure knowing those I've gotten to know, uh, those who I've not gotten to know because of the size of the school. Uh, my sentiments are still sincere. I wish you the best, wish you peace, love, happiness, and Godspeed. Best luck to the class of 89. You're just a 